I don't know where to start to thank all the brilliant people at Centenary Church who love their neighbours and serve the community. Uh, in Volunteers Week, we'd like to thank Joe and Martin. They produce amazing meals for anybody who needs them. I'd like to thank um, uh, Janet and Derek. There are Wombles, the oldest Wombles in Boston, I think, constantly clearing up and keeping the church beautiful. We're so grateful. I want to thank Audrey. She mails out um, letters every week to keep in touch with people with all the news and everything from our communities. I want to thank all our door stewards who welcome people and keep everyone safe. I want to thank our audiovisual operators who, who do sound and vision in the church. That's terrific. And what about you? Do you want to volunteer at Centenary Church? We'd love to have you. And there's loads to do as we look to the future. But God bless all volunteers in this volunteers week we love you thank you to chris and deirdre our chairman and treasurer for everything that they do for pinchbeck kids club we couldn't do it without you thank, thank you, you. Hi, I'm Mary from Green Synergy. We're a Lincoln-based charity that uses gardening to help people socialise, learn and thrive. And we'd like to say a massive thank you to all our volunteers, our project volunteers, trustees, members of the local community and local businesses who together have helped us create a two and a half acre garden on derelict land. If you'd like to get involved in future, please visit us, www.greensynergy.org.uk. Thank you. Hello, my name's Steve Bond and I'm from St Barnabas Hospice. This Volunteers Week, we'd like to say a big thank you and well done to everybody that's volunteered to support their local community in the last year. At St Barnabas, our volunteers have begun a COVID bereavement support line, they've moved bereavement counselling online and helped by volunteering in our charity shops. You can volunteer in one of our shops now or one of our inpatient units in Lincoln and Grantham that we're reopening to volunteers again soon. Volunteering for St Barnabas helps local people when they need it the most by helping us to provide the excellent level of palliative and end-of-life care that we're known for. Hi. I'm Peter Stanton Guest. I would like to say a very big thank you to our team of volunteers who throughout the whole of lockdown gave up lots of their time to ensure that our parish residents in both Dry Doddington and Westborough were helped and encouraged wherever they were needed. Supplies of food parcels, fruit baskets and treats for the children and also that very special Easter bunch of daffodils on that rather wet weekend were just a few of the many trips we made to various households to help them throughout this awful period. Vicky, Cheryl, Bex, Sally, Jan, Rachel and your lovely children bless you all for everything you did. Thank you. Volunteering has been at the heart of what we do for over 80 years and every hour you give helps us with our work to fight diabetes. From Norfolk to Essex, you've helped us support anyone affected by diabetes. From Shropshire to Warwickshire, you've helped us work with communities at high risk of developing type 2 diabetes. And from Leicestershire to Lincolnshire, you've helped us to fight for better care for people living with diabetes. Volunteers like you help us fight for a world where diabetes can do no harm. We couldn't do it without you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, I'm Caroline. I'm the Chief Exec of YMCA Lincolnshire. I just wanted to say a huge thank you to all our volunteers this Volunteers Week for everything you do for our beneficiaries, for the communities we serve, to help our charity stay alive. This year you have been outstanding. We couldn't do without you and we are so proud to work alongside you and to have you as part of our team. Hello, I'm Alison from LRSN. For Volunteers Week, everyone at Lincoln Rural Support Network wanted to say a huge thank you to all our volunteers. You are at the heart of everything we do to help and support Lincolnshire's rural and farming families through tough times to help them get back on track. Thank you to you all.